Okay, one, two, three, and clap. Hey, it's Duck with 992, and it's been a couple of weeks since I've done this, but uh, again, I've made some changes. Instead of me recreating posters with different actors, instead, now I'm either going to revamp or remake. For a revamp, I'm basically going to be using the same actors for the same film or TV show, but just make it into a different genre. On remake, I'm just going to recreate the film or TV show using different actors or actresses. Pretty simple. One other change as well, I'm going to be doing either a film film, a TV show or a video game just because I think that might actually be pretty interesting. Also I'm not just going to be looking at actors and actresses, I'm also going to be looking at content creators and like uh, streamers as well just again because I think that this will give it a lot more variety also because I need to get my name out there so uh, but yeah without further ado let's get to it. Okay, as I said before, we're going to be doing a revamp or a remake. So let's just pick... Let's pick this one. Multi-lane madness. Okay, let's have a look at this. Wait, can I even have a look? No, I can't. I'm just going to have to start. Oh, looks decent. Alright, man, this is a slow one. But yeah, these ones are just going to be cut down super, super short now. It could be... Oh, it could be a revamp. It's revamp versus revamp, but which revamp's going to take it? Oh, and it's a revamp. So yeah, I just got to recreate a pasta with uh, different genres. So that'll be fun but uh, I'll get back to that in a minute because I gotta go take the dog out Okay, now that I've done that and I've taken the dog out on a walk, which if I'm red, I can't see if I'm red, but if I'm red, then at least you know why. Okay, so TV, film, game. I really like these ones. You ever go to like like a big swimming pool and you're younger and you have like these slides where you'd have to literally go around in a circle like this and go down the middle. I used to have one in black and cold waves and it was brilliant. But what a game was first. Must be actually rare for to come down the middle like this. Oh, Oh, TV. Oh, I thought TV were going to get it. Oh, film has just jumped in front and taken this. Oh, they're going to be revamping a film. Oh my god, are the things moving as well? Yeah, so it must have like gone off one of these ramps or something because it went just like dunked straight in there. Okay, I guess we're doing a film. Got to look at what genre to do next. You know what, I think I'm actually going to delete social just because I don't really like, I like, I've looked into it in between sessions and I'm not really too particularly fond of it, so yeah, goodbye social. I'm gonna add something in its place, like maybe like party. Uh, do we have racing? We do not have racing, so we'll add racing. We do not have musical, so we'll add musical. You know what, we'll add family friendly as well. Just one more streaming service. So this will be films that I like only made on like Netflix, Amazon and uh, you know, like Disney Plus and stuff. So yeah, there we go. But I think that one's better. So what on earth? How am I going to follow this? This is just the cake here. Where's Gladys? Gladys, where you at? I mean, I see boxes. Oh, we're off. Oh, I'm liking this texture though. This reminds me of like Ministry of Magic for some reason. So wait, if they fall off, what? 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 No way. It's actually no. I should have just jumped over it. Wow. So wait, how do you win? How is this? How is this meant to? What? I am so confused. I don't know. I don't know what to. Paranoid Fiction. <gasps> Paranoid Fiction has it. So what is that like? Uh... Oh, what's that film that just came out? It's like The Invisible Man or something. Wow. That's pretty cool. So it's essentially like a, a thriller sort of. So winner is Paranoid Fiction. Wow, there's only two winners in that. That's insane. Okay, uh, let's just see what counts as paranoid fiction. Oh! Oh, the thing! Oh, this is actually pretty cool. From the looks of it, this looks like a, an old genre. Wait, would Final Destination count 20 paranoia movies? There we go. The thing, obviously. The Departed is kind of darkly. Oh, this one's interesting. It's like they're all like drawn and stuff. Oh, this could actually be pretty fun. Bong Boogie. Let's do this one. Oh, pretty cool. It's a pretty simple one, this one. I like it. Yeah, okay, so you got philosophical. Don't know how that's gonna turn out. Okay. Mystery. Ooh. Wait, racing. How's that gonna work? Oh my god, anime. Oh my god, it's fantasy and anime. Anime could 100% take this. And anime is taking it. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh wow. Anime fantasy, the magical realism. All those are pretty, pretty cool. So I got a term paranoid thriller or whatever it was into an anime. Wow. <laughs> okay. Guess what? That's what I'm doing. <laughs> I'm actually really liking the sound of this. This could be really cool. But uh, yeah, I'll uh, 
be back in a minute. Back, uh, I've got about 40 films here, so in no particular order we've got things like The Matrix, Total Recall, Shutter Island which is a good one, The Wicker Man, uh, Invaders from Mars, yeah like that, that's like the full the full list, uh, we've also got The Thing 1982 and The Thing 2011, very important difference, oh wait I've just realised I've got Total Recall in there twice, wait didn't Total Recall have a remake? Yeah, it was a 2012. Uh, might as well put that in, why not? It does count original. I kind of hope it's the thing. I can't lie, but I'd be happy with all the others as well. Oh, it's this one. Oh, Chinatown. That's a good one. That is such a good one. If you haven't seen Chinatown, I highly recommend it. Oh my god, Chinatown just went straight down there. Which one's this? What is that? Oh. Oh, <gasps> Chinatown has taken it. So, wait. Oh, that's. Yeah, I used this on stream, didn't I? So, we're going to be doing Chinatown. An anime on Chinatown. That, I actually really like, like the idea of that. Because I've got to make it similar. Because she's. Oh my god, i got to turn Jack Nicholson into an anime character. How am I going to do that? But yeah, alright, looks like I've got to be uh, doing this. So, we're uh, just going to go get some assets and then uh, we'll get to editing. So, yeah, see you in a bit. Okay, just uh, got done with the edit and thought I'd just like walk through some of my decisions and stuff. Obviously because it's anime, I decided to go with what the Japanese names would be for the characters as well as like um, the title of the film in Japanese. Um, I tried to have it as like close as possible to the original thing. See, like I just, I've also like just nearly copied the uh, border around it as you can see. I've also decided to, oh what's this character's name again? Hang on. Yeah, a character from uh, Lupin 3 by the name of uh, Koichi Zengita, just because he like looks like a uh, Jack Nicholson's character in the actual film. As you can see, there's like clear similarities between these two characters for sure. Probably maybe not the trench coat, but I think it's fine with what we've got. I even tried to give his look like a similar look to the character from the film as well. So like you see, he's got the black eye, he's got the bandages, and uh, I even ended up using a different uh, cigarette and just like painted over his other 
other one. And in the back, we've got the character uh, Natalie from uh, Back and All. And if you haven't seen that, I really recommend it. Here, we just got like a, an image of Chinatown or, or like an animated depiction of Chinatown in the background. I'm not sure who did the original art for it, so I'm sorry. Um, and I've used an alloy from Ghost in the Shell as like the alloy which um, Jack Nicholson's character is standing in. Um, and he's like a fence to like separate those two, as well as a car from the actual show Back and All to put uh, Natalie, who is Faye Dunaway's. And same thing really with Natalie. See, there's like similarities between these two characters as well, just because of the hair, like really, um, as well as like the look. But uh, yeah, that's uh, pretty much it. Yeah, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I stream uh, every Monday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. Um, on Mondays, I've decided to do like a Marvel's Monday kind of thing. So like, every Monday, I'm going to be doing basically doing like similar edits to these, but on stream. They're going to be about streamers and content creators only. Um, just because I think that'll be pretty fun. But yeah, like I said, uh, like, comment, and subscribe if you like the video, and I'll uh, see you in the next one. Peace.